Welcome into the 901 and today we start with 901 FC at practice today players were still talking about head coach Ben Pierman's midseason coach of the year nomination. No, 100% fully deserved and hopefully, hopefully come the end of the year he can, he can get the actual award and maybe a trophy with it as well too. Pierman had the club top of the table earlier this season. They're on the road this weekend against Indy 11. And in his turn at the mic at SEC Media Days, Josh Heupel said the key for his balls to build on last year is to finish the fourth quarter strong. It's not what you'd expect from a team that only blew one fourth quarter lead last season. What they need to do is improve that pass defense, which allowed an SEC worst 273 yards per game last year. Well, the Cardinals return from the All-Star break tomorrow, but their name is all over the rumor mill today. The Nationals are reportedly looking to trade their superstar outfielder Juan Soto, and the Cards are one of the teams being linked to the 24-year-old. Now, odds makers have St. Louis in the top four of teams who could land Soto. We're officially on Hug Watch at AutoZone Park because a lot of Redbirds could be on the move if this goes down. And apparently poaching golf's brightest stars wasn't enough for the controversial Live Golf League. Now they're targeting one of basketball's biggest names. Charles Barkley told the New York Post that he will play in the Live Golf Pro-Am when the Saudi-backed league plays next week in New Jersey. Liv is uh, courting the Basketball Hall of Famer to also be a broadcaster for their events. How about that? Hey, have a topic. Connect with us on any platform. With your 901, I'm Clayton Collier.